Supraorbital and supratrochlear nerves are very important for the frontal recipient side block. By blocking these two nerves, you make the patient really very comfortable. Palpate the notch in the supraorbital bone and mark it. That is the supraorbital nerve coming out. One centimeter medial to supraorbital nerve is the supratrochlear nerve. And these two nerves literally block the whole of the frontal forehead and scalp of the patient and you put a very small amount of local anesthetic by blocking these two nerves and then you can easily and comfortably freeze the recipient site of the patient you should use very fine needles and i usually use 30 use 30 gauge very fine needles for this purpose and that actually makes the patient very comfortable and after that uh, injecting this diluted uh, tumescent fluid then i reinforce my uh, blocks by local anesthetic and then i give small doses of local anesthetic uh, at the hairline as well to fortify my blocks this is the way I give supraorbital supratrochlear blocks. And then I give small doses of local anesthetic that is xylocaine with adrenaline at the hairline.